Hello, BookTube. Another quick video. I'll try to keep this under five minutes. Uh, there's something I wanted to bring up. It's not, not explicitly book-related, uh, but it would connect with this channel. Uh, so I feel like I have a, a, a license. And also, you're an incredible resource, so I'd like to take advantage of that. Uh, I, in a video a while ago, I brought up the idea of creating uh, essentially SteveDonahue.com, SteveDonahue.net, something like that, a, a website for me that has, uh, would have these videos on it. It would have, you know, uh, my, my Twitter feed. It would have, uh, and more importantly, it would have all of my reviews. If I, if I, you know, it would, I would go back through my catalog of reviews for the, for instance, the national on the other side of the world, all my reviews for the, for the Washington post or the Christian science monitor or anything like that. And, uh, store them there searchable with cover illustrations and whatnot uh in it's a sort of one place where you could go right now if you go to open letters monthly the literary journal where i have the honor to be the managing editor you can find uh my blog steve reads which is 10 years old this year and has a ton of stuff to read uh, and you can also find open letters weekly which is the the segment on the front of our main page that is my my colleagues very nicely gave it to me as kind of a playpen where I review at shorter length a large number of new books that I get in the mail, uh, and I, I share it with Norman Lebrecht, the the literary critic, the musical critic Norman Lebrecht, who uh, we we run a column by him, an album pick by him on the weekend, but it's mostly me, <laughs> and uh, and also at Open Letters Monthly you get the monthly table of contents longer two thousand two thousand five hundred word review that I write every month uh, and that I've been doing for 10 years. So, uh, right now, I'm in the middle of my second year with the Tudors. The year with the Tudors, too. <laughs> uh, so it's, if, you, if you can stand as much Tudor stuff as you can possibly stand is what I'm doing now. Uh, and right now, if you go to Open Letters Monthly, you will get that. And you won't get anything else. Now, that's a lot. But that's that's half or less than half of my writing output especially now that I'm a fixture at the Christian Science Monitor, so that I'm, I'm doing one piece a week there, plus a three-book roundup, and all, all sorts of other places, too. Uh, the, I, I floated the idea here of making a place, a, a website, that would be a one place to go for all that. Uh, and a lot of you responded positively, and I got a lot of emails, too, saying that it'd be, you know, you'd love to see that. And also, the more I thought about it, the more I liked the idea myself. Uh, and that brings us to, <laughs> you, you surely didn't think that you were going to encourage me to do that and then just wait for me to do it. Now, we're in this together. I have no technical expertise or my videos wouldn't look like this now, would they? <laughs> so what I, what I want is to, to pick your brains. How should I go about that? In fact, are any of you web designers or do you know web designers? You might be willing to take on this task and and uh, confab with me in order to create a website, in order to nail down a domain name, stevedonahue.com or net or org or whatever, or saintdonahue.net or or whatever, uh, and then create it. And, and, you know, we'll decide what it's going to look like. If, if you can do that work and you want to consult with me, I would love to do that. And if you know somebody who wants to, uh, I am a paying customer, so uh, that's what this video is for. I'm all in favor, now that I've given it a lot of thought, I'm all in favor of stevedonahue.com, but I need help to make it. Uh, and I did some research online. Of course, if you have any questions about life, the universe, and everything, you go to YouTube and you search, you research there on videos. Uh, and a lot of the, the really, the, the, the video makers, a lot of the posters that seemed to know what they were doing, the smarter ones, the ones that aren't schmarmy or trying to sell you something, the ones that I got a good vibe from almost all agreed that the the prefab paid website makers, places like uh, there's one called, uh, with an alligator as an uh, or or GoDaddy or, or or stuff like that, uh, <clears throat> they all tended to agree that those things are are a, a siren song that they they tempt you with how easy they are, but that they're actually they actually end up being no easier and far worse derivatively than just paying someone to make a site of your own. So uh, I'm kind of leaning towards doing that, which is the point of this video. So uh, feel free to, to 
you know, to reach out in the comments field or, or email me, uh, and let's talk about this. If it's, if it's possible to do, I'd like to do it. And if, and, uh, as, as as some of you will know, uh, especially if, you, if you've known me in real life, once I decide that I want to do something, I want to do it overnight. <laughs> so so I'm ready, and we can get right on this as soon as I have somebody with the technical expertise to do it, because I certainly don't have that. If I tried to do a, a you know a DYI, I, it would be a disaster. <laughs> Better by far that I that I hire someone. Uh, so. I thought I'd make a video about that just to see if there's anybody out there. This is a, a tremendous crowd of intelligent people we've got. So I'll uh, I'll let you go for now, and we'll get back to books next time. Thank you, BookTube.